Happy Thursday, Panthers. I'm Arlen. And I'm your actual favorite anchor, Dominic. And it's time for West Park TV. Last Saturday was our Lights Up Tangled Theme Junior Prom. It was a night to remember full of lights, dancing, singing, and fresh tacos. Yearbook has been working hard to capture the West Park experience. Here's Ben with some information on how to get your yearbook so you can look back on all your fun memories. Hey Panthers, I'm Simeon. I'm Brooke. I'm Lily. And I'm Rocco, and we're all editors for the Panthera staff. We just wanted to take some time to explain senior distribution on May 15th and after school distribution on Friday, May 17th. In order to receive your yearbook, you must have a distribution ticket. Your distribution ticket will be distributed to you during fourth period. If you don't have a fourth period, you will get it in your first period. And if you have any questions, email Ms. Boljohn. We will be holding after school yearbook distributions on May 17th, which is a Friday, in the Panther Arena on the balcony area. Please be sure to bring your ticket for a smooth transaction. Senior distribution is in the Student Union on Wednesday, May 15th from 8.30 to 9.15. There will be donuts provided. Seniors, tomorrow is your last day to buy your beat-down Chromebooks. If you love them, make sure you come to the finance office tomorrow with a cheap price of $40. Tomorrow is also the last day to buy senior ball tickets at the price of $80. Next week, the price bumps up to $85, and based on the crowd, that would follow junior prom, tickets, it's better now than later. Hey Panthers, this is Mr. Kentris with a super important announcement for seniors. Seniors, you got an email from me about senior scrolls. We need you to fill that out. Ms. Pagnini and I are working really hard to celebrate you with an amazing gift on your way out. So please fill out Senior Scrolls. Thank you. Athletic Signing Day is for seniors who are continuing their athletic careers at the collegiate level. Yesterday, many of them made commitments. If you want to see the live stream, go to West Park TV's page and follow the link. Speaking of athletics, let's take it over to Treasure for the Sports Report. What's good, West Park? It's Treasure, and this week's Sports Report will be presented by individual players from the respective sports. Let's take it to Morgan. Hi, I'm Morgan Cho, and I'm a crease defender for the girls lacrosse here at West Park. A down would certainly be the fact that most of the girls on the team have never touched a lacrosse stick before, so that would definitely be a hurdle that we needed to jump over. Um, one of the ups of the season, though, was the fact that we all got to trauma bond together and learn it all new things together. Losing most of our games was probably what brought us together the most, to be honest, because we had to go through the hardships together. We've gotten to know each other a lot, which in some of my other sports here at West Park, I haven't gotten to know the girls as much. Now on to girls softball. Hi, I'm Brooklyn. I am one of the outfielders here on the West Park softball's team. Currently, we are 6-0 in first in league, and we are doing really well with a 12-3 overall total. In the beginning of the year, we definitely made like a rule type of thing that we all talked and came together to figure out what our team goals were. And then we have stuck to that and how, and our coaches have helped us stick to it. And now we, with our chemistry and how well we all get along, it's now just going. Hi, I'm Caitlin and I'm a jumper. And I'm Johanna, I'm a pole vaulter and sprinter. So far this season, we are undefeated on the boys and girls hey. for soft teams. We are 2-3 for girls varsity and 4-1 for bo boys varsity, leading into league finals this week, hoping to compete well. And we've broken 19 out of our 32 records this year. I got to compete in the Stanford Inventational, which was really cool. With um, We got to like watch some like college track athletes compete, which is really nice. My coaches personally tell us just to get out of our heads and do what we came here to do, whether that be jumping or sprinting or in any of our events, they just push for our success. Thank, Thank you, you and back, back to, to treasure. treasure. Thanks, Caitlin and Johanna. To finish this week off, Baseball had their strikeout cancer game against Vista Del Lago, honoring those who have family members fighting against cancer. On Monday and Tuesday, the tennis singles and doubles players competed in the FBL League Tournament. Stunt won Friday at Galt, but lost on Saturday. This means they're now working towards winning state. Congrats. Huge shout out to boys volleyball, who is now first in the league, going undefeated 10 to zero. Our boys lacrosse team has an amazing season, but sadly came up short against Vista Del Lago, five to 21. And yesterday, our swim team traveled to Elk Grove to compete in their sectionals. Well, that's it for this week. I'm Treasure, reporting for West Park TV, and back to you. 
Yesterday was West Park's first band and choir concert with a guest appearance from Chilton's Jazz Band. Some of you may already be aware of the sad news. Miss Dell is leaving West Park. We decided to create something special to celebrate the time we had in her presence. Dell, I just wanted to say thank you so much and I'm going to miss you a lot because you always protected me and always were there for me through the really hard times and you always spread good energy, positive vibes to everybody and you're just super sweet and we're all going to miss you so much. Miss Dell, I just want to say thank you so much. You've always been there for me and every time like I was going through something, you were always the one there for me. You always give me the best advice and I just want I really appreciate that and I'm going to miss you so much. Before you leave, I just wanted to tell you what you meant to me. There was a time when I came in very upset and sad and crying, and you just helped me think before I make my next move. And you talked to me for about 30 minutes, actually, and you let me stay there until I felt comfortable enough to go back to class. And it really means a lot to know that you care about not just me, but all the other students that feel the same way about you. Love you, Miss Dell. Hey doll, I'm gonna miss you so much. And I just wanna say thank you for being so welcoming and sweet. Um, you've been one of my best friends here and you've taught me so much. Del, it's not gonna be the same without you. Honestly, what's it gonna be like when I walk down the hall and you're not there? I'm really gonna miss your laugh down the hall and just your kind words every morning. Thank you, Miss Dale. Um, you mean a lot to me. When I first came to West Park, you were like the first person there that really helped me. So, and you just did the little things is what I uh, appreciate. Thank you, Miss Dale, for uh, always being there for me when I needed you, letting me vent to you. I mean, thank you for picking, helping me pick my prom suit, too. Always had, you know, I know what to wear, I know what to do. You told me, you got to go here, you got to go to Mid Warehouse. I didn't even know what Mid Warehouse was. I'm like, okay. I'm like, thank you, Miss Dale. You know, you helped me pick my prom suit. You saw the pictures, too. I know I look good. That was all because of you. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Dell. I really love you. Thank you, Ms. Dell, for always being there for me. You're like a second mom to me. You've taught me a whole bunch of life lessons, and you've like guided me through my high school career, basically. I'm sad you can't be here for my senior year, but you're still going to be in my memories. I'm still going to have you present my name at graduation, so you better be there. Ms. Dell, just want to say I'm going to miss you. I appreciate our rivalry together. It has been a lot of fun to have that at work and to talk to you uh, as I'm walking out. And I'm just going to leave you with Go pack up. I appreciate Ms. Dell because she always guided me through tough times and her love and support has always guided me into the right direction. I was in a really bad situation and she would always just help me through the tough times, always giving me the right advice at the right exact time and I appreciate you and I'm going to miss you a lot through my senior year. I just wanted to take the time and let you know how much I appreciate you. You have always been there for me this whole four years of high school. You really helped me a lot. You helped me get a job, my first job, um, even though my grades were still bad, but you still vouched for me. You just have really made my life better. And it's really sad to see you go, but I hope that Antelope treats you well, and I hope the kids over there appreciate you as much as we all do. All right, guys, so Miss Dell is leaving the facility of West Park, but my heart is always here. I am with you guys always. So when you guys are thinking the things, you're making decisions, I need you to be like, what would Miss Dell want me to do? Because I know it's in you guys. I'm only up the road. You guys can stop by anybody's desk or whatever. And actually, you guys also have my email. Same email, I'm in the same district. Like, hit me up. I would love to hear from you guys. I am just a couple miles away, but you guys are in my heart today and always. This week we had a couple of Panthers try to answer the age old question, what's, what's in the box? Feels nice. Is this like a tree? Whoa! What the? <laughs> Is this like a a cactus oh wait i can wait yeah it's this christmas tree yes let's go why is it wet <laughs> oh! wait what <laughs> i don't even know this is disgusting is it a lava lamp <laughs> no. oh my god why are there chunks in it <laughs> Ew! Is it a dog toy? 
No. I, I have no idea what this is. A squishy. Oh my god, it's like actually like getting... Oh my god, is it... I don't know what this is and I don't like it. It's not your fingers! Oh god, I don't know. Slime? Oh my god, an olive! Yes! Ew, I hate olives! <laughs> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh, it's some sort of bar. No. No, it's a remote. Wing, 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 wing. Next item. <laughs> <laughs> What is it? Like, I can't hear, like, all you guys laughing. <laughs> what does it feel like that? <laughs> what is that? Whoa. <laughs> it's a bell! Okay, if you, is this a is this a glass or a cup? Oh my god, it's so slimy! Oh my gosh, <laughs> is this slime? No. We have no idea what this is. This is not slime. Mm. I honestly have no idea what this is. Okay. <laughs> like gummy bear or something? Is it Jello? Oh oh oh! <laughs> I don't want to put my finger in it. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, it's it's a uh, it's apple something. Uh, it, it's it smells like apple. What is it? It's cinnamon toast crunch cereal. Oh, okay. I know it can't be anything crazy. Um. Describe what you're doing. Grab it. Okay, so it feels like I should feel it. It's like round. It has like different edges to it. What is that? Wait, wait. Is this a rubber ducky? Yeah. Hey. Wait, let me try to feel. It don't have no sunglasses on. It don't. Does it have a pirate hat? No. No. Um. Wait. I'm trying to think. What else did I? Oh, it's Santa Claus. Yes. Hey, let's go. Yay! Can I call a friend? <laughs> it's a phone. <laughs> huh? Phone, iPhone 12. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ew. Ew. <laughs> That's disgusting. Is it a sponge? Oh, it's one of those things to clean. <laughs> I won't put my hand in it though. Okay, okay. It's like moist, slimy. Ooh, I don't like this. Nah, it's all over my hand or something. Ew! Ah, <laughs> oh, it's cold. It's wet. Uh, can I give up? Oh, that's yogurt. That's yogurt. Mmm. That's 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 cherry. That's that's <laughs> banana. That's banana. I swear to you, that's strawberry. Tomorrow is School Lunch Hero Day. Make sure you thank our fantastic lunch workers who work hard to provide for us every day. Also, next week is Staff Appreciation Week, so be sure to show love and support to the staff who helped shape West Park into what it is today. Well, that's all for this week, Panthers. And remember, we only have four weeks left, but keep in mind, Panthers, our time is now. <laughs>